great phoneticist who studied the sound of the human voice divide consonants into two types voiceless and voiced voice consonants require the use of the vocal cord to produce their signature sound voiceless consonants do not both types use the breath the teeth the lips and upper palate to further modify speech an easy way to determine whether a consonant is voiced or not is to place a finger on a throat when you pronounce a sound or a letter if you feel a vibration then that consonant is a voice one so whenever there is a vibration of shaking of the vocal cords then that consonant is a voice one but if you place a finger on the foot and there is no vibration or shaking of the vocal cord then that very consonant is a voiceless one so basically there is vibration or shaking in the pronunciation or the production of a voice consonant but on the other end there is no shaking or vibration in the production of a voiceless consonant another difference between voiced consonant and voiceless consonant is that voiced consonant require the use of the vocal cord to produce the hard and the percussive sound when it comes to the voiceless consonant they are slack and allow the air to flow from the lungs to the mouth as you know we have got 24 consonant sounds in phonetic alphabet from that 15 of them are voiced consonant and nine are voiceless so all in all we have 15 voiced consonants and nine voiceless consonants it is crucial to make the distinction between a voiceless consonant and a voiced one because if you use the voiced consonant in lieu of the voiceless consonant it will definitely result in a complete change in the meaning as I said, when it comes to the consonant sounds in phonetic alphabet, we number 15 voice consonants and 9 voiceless consonant sounds. Speaking of the voiceless consonant sound, they are f, like in father or in fat, h, h like in hot hospital or house k, k. we can find it in the word keep cat or leakage p, p, p. like in put paper or push s, like the sound the snake makes s, like in sister son we can find it in a word teacher take this sound is made by pulling the tongue behind the teeth and blowing the air if you put it between the teeth like in think or at the end of the word bath or mouth or month the next is the shh like when you tell somebody keep quiet shh, you can find it at the beginning of the word shoes and at the end of the word finish or wash the next is the ch ch like the country chad ch ch you can find it at the beginning and at the end of the word church or at the end of the word catch or watch now when it comes to the voiced consonant sound they are b, b like the word 
beak, bird, d, d, at the beginning and end of the word dad, and at the beginning at the, at the beginning of the word daughter, g, g, we can find it in the word go, get, girl, l, l, we can find it at the end of the word call, and at the beginning of the word lose. M, m, like in mother, or mine, or climb, at the end, n, like in nose, nature, or at the end of the word sin. R, you can find it at the beginning of the word rice, red, and white. V, you can find it at the beginning of the word vowel. And at the end of the word, believe. W, w. You can find it in the word work, worst, and waste. Z, you can find it at the beginning of the word zoo. At the end of the word, organize or tease. The next is y, y. You can find it in the word unity. Yes or beyond. J, j, like uh, in uh, manage, in uh, message or fridge. J, you can find it in the word uh, sabotage or uh, pleasure. The next sound is uh, v. You can find it in the word to bother or at the end of the word with. And the last sound for the voice the consonant is mm. You can find it in the word sing or bang. That's all for the voiceless consonant and voiced consonant sounds. Great! I hope you have had a good grab of the voicing in English phonetic alphabet. In the next video, We'll be looking at the pronunciation of ED at the end of regular verbs. You can find other videos in the playlist to trigger your pronunciation. That's all for this lesson. I hope you have had a good grab of the voicing in English pronunciation. Thank you very much for watching and I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Thank you.